They have the Canon Rebel T7i. I am filming this with the Canon T3i. So I've come a long way, Canon. Great job. This is the Canon M6. This might be my new vlogging camera. Flip out screen, very important. Mm -hmm. And it's also so light. I wish you could do it like a side by side comparison. I know. <laughs> So I'm back at home with the new Canon EOS M6, I believe. Uh, this was recommended to me by my friend Jesse. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, so far I don't really know what to think about it other than that it's a lot lighter. I don't know how the sound is or what the quality difference is, so I guess this is just a test. This is using the new camera. I am currently on my way to the west side, doing a couple things out there. First, we are going to the Hourglass event. They came out with a new highlighter. I'm really excited to try them out. They are cream. And then after, gonna have dinner with Ashley and Vinan. We're gonna talk about our goals for 2018. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be a very full night. And then when I get back home, we are celebrating Robin's belated birthday. It's been a really long time since we've all been together, so it's gonna be nice. It is 5.30 p.m. I'm about to have a shot of coffee. And then head off to dinner. Having a belated birthday dinner with this one. We've got a little gem salad and hamachi. Yum. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of my guilty pleasures. Oh yeah. Oh, and another one of my guilty pleasures. California roll. Happy birthday to you. Make a wish. Make a wish. I love you. Oh. I love you, ma. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everybody, I am back in the office. Today was a very, very productive day. Filmed the B-roll for the thrift haul video and the speaking portion. And that's why my office is a mess again. I'm so sad, I feel like I just cleaned it. But yeah, right now I'm gonna start editing my vlog for you guys for the Sunday video. It is my goal to start uploading two times on YouTube. Uh, later on, I'm going to my friend Kelly's house to help her clean her house. I think if I wasn't doing YouTube, I would definitely be doing something in like the service industry or even like cleaning houses. I freaking love to organize, especially when it's not my stuff. Like I would love to be a part of the hoarders cast just to like excavate like an entire property and just redecorate it and reorganize. Yeah, that's what I'm doing today. And then we're gonna have dinner with Anna, Jesse, and Claire and Ben. So it's gonna be good to have a little reunion, see every, see some familiar faces. Oh my goodness, about to just, you know, gain back what we just worked out. <laughs> we got a little breakfast burrito, let's dig in. <laughs> She's amazed with my new vlogging camera. It's amazing. It's so light, feel it. Wow. Taking over. I will show you the spread. We're having a house meeting at my house, so 
We have a mm. cheese plate. We have chips and salsa. Annie's. So good. These are amazing. <laughs> and Greek yogurt dip and some veggies. <laughs> if there's a heaven on earth, it is this place. Oh, yes. Look at their plates. They are rammed. Two full plates of salad. Meanwhile, us. us. We're pacing ourselves, you know? Yes. You gotta eat this all. You're better. Ben, that looks pretty ambitious as well. Yeah. Andy's plate, very reasonable. It's a feast. They make the best salads in the world here. It feels like comforting, doesn't it? Well done. Well done. <laughs> huh. This will do. Hi guys, I am in the car. I am currently on my way to go shoot with my friend Rebecca. If you guys have been watching my channel for a long time, then you know who she is. She is one of my friends that I met at community college. Uh, it's actually really like so pure how we met. I remember it was like during one of our really long breaks and I just saw her sitting down on one of the planters and she had really cool style and I was like, I'm just gonna go out to her and say that I like her outfit and become friends with her. That was my objective uh, Because when I got out of high school, I was like, you know what a lot of my high school friends have left But I'm gonna try and create a new community. She became my friend and we just hit it off We had a lot of the same interests. I am obsessed with this bookshelf They've got little knickknacks. Oh My gosh, I'm getting a lot of inspiration for my bookshelf honestly, and there's the woman of the hour, Hello. Rebecca. <laughs> Hi. Forget Stella though. Hi, Stella. Hey, baby. Cute the living room is. It's like a spread and kinfolk or something. <laughs> We've made our selects, and now Becca's gonna do her thing on Lightroom. Do you remember the first time we met, Becca? Yeah. I was, yeah, so I was sitting uh, uh, on a planter. Right? Yeah, yeah, on a planter. I was like a planter. Uh -huh. I was sitting on a planter and you're like, hi, you look lonely. Do you want to hang out with me? Wait. And I was like, oh, I am lonely? Yeah, <laughs> sure. <laughs> oh my God. See, I like stone cold just get, went up to yeah. her. You're like, you look like you want some friends. I'm like, did I say you? that? Something like that. That is a miracle in like someone's <laughs> life. Like their first year in college, someone comes up to you and is like, do you want to be your friend? And I was like, yeah, sure. <laughs> is, this, is this happening? Like, do not like second guess whether or not they're going to think you're weird mm -hmm. because you're actually going to make their day and you might be friends with them for as long as we've been friends. No. So. <laughs> Here is my green goddess smoothie and Alexa got the peanut butter. You guys, this is truly a miracle. I am going away to San Francisco for a couple of days and I'm only flying with a carry-on! I can't even think of the last time I traveled like this. Uh, but yeah, Amy inspired me to travel light and so I am. Normally I always have like two bags no matter how long the trip is. I'll always have a carry-on and then I'll have a big one. So excited to just breeze by. Uh, oh, I also can bring my global entry card because I'm traveling alone. So let me go grab that. Yes, I'm heading to San Jose slash San Francisco to go visit Sarah. I haven't seen her since the holidays. And so we thought we would do kind of like a, I don't know, like a trip together because I haven't seen her in such a long time. Check this global entry out. I am flying into San Jose, which is where she lives, and then she's gonna show me where she works, where she lives, and so I can finally see what her side of the world looks like. And then we are traveling all the way to Oakland. I think it's like an hour drive. And then we're gonna stay at an Airbnb. But yeah, this weekend should be super fun. I'm so excited. Uh, so yeah, I gotta go get an Uber right now because I'm about to be late. I just 
landed in San Jose and I saw Sarah's lovely little home and she packed her bags and now we are here in San Francisco and we are at our lovely Airbnb here in Rockridge. It is perfect for two people. Here is the bed we'll be sleeping on. A little desk area, which will be nice in the daytime. A cute little kitchen space. Got a kettle. We can make some tea, perhaps. And we've got a full fridge with a microwave. Uh, so yeah, Sarah's just gonna finish getting ready, and then we're gonna do a night out in the town. Oh man, last night was so much fun. We had dinner. Oh, oh, that's cute. I like it. Super chill, yeah. I yeah. Today to watch. Mm, true. Last night was so much fun. We started off. Where did we start off? Oh, we went Here. to the Golden Squirrel in Oakland. Oh, that's what it's called. Yeah. <laughs> I only remember the name because there were squirrels cool. everywhere. I was like, wow, really cool. going for the theme. We danced so much. That was um, fun. Yeah, it was like really fun. The first fun. ten minutes was just. Our high school. <laughs> yes, no, literally, they're they're playing like hip hop songs from our era, from like two thousand five. Yeah. I didn't even know that was a thing. Yeah, right. But we literally knew every single song yes. that came out. We're like, oh, we know this song. Every song. Oh, we know this song. Oh. <laughs> I love ten fifteen because there's so many rooms. There was like three different yeah, stages, cool. and they're both they're all distinct as well. And then our friend Secundo was DJing the main stage. And then we saw the Yin Yang twi twins. I woke up and I was like, Took a nice walk to Trader Joe's. She got me oranges. She was like, what do you want from Trader I Joe's? I was like, Advil. I was going to ask oranges. what kind of eye drops you wanted, but oh, I didn't so want to nice. get you out of your like half sleep. I'm like, oh, if I ask you one thing, that place is promising for the eye drops you need. They might be overpriced though. What are we doing today? We're going to go get chicken sandwiches at Big, Big Sale Betty. Betty. Oh my god. And strawberry shortcake. Uh -huh. And then we're gonna go, what, what funeral? Is it? Or a funeral? <laughs> what cemetery is it? We're going to the Oakland Cemetery. Oakland Cemetery. Yeah. <laughs> well, here we have the famous fried chicken sandwich at Big Sale Betty. I love this sandwich. Gotta have some hot sauce on the side. <laughs> I can't believe we're eating. We walked for like years. <laughs> I know. We went the wrong way. I directed us the opposite way, so I added an extra mile to our trip. <laughs> Here we are. We walked all the way to the cemetery. How are you feeling? Warm. <laughs> So we have our apple pie from Bake Sale Betty yes. and we're going to have it on a bench here. At last. Oh my god. Oh my. We didn't bring forks. <laughs> Everybody, it is Monday afternoon. I am back from the Bay Area and it feels good to be back home but honestly I could have used one extra day in the Bay. That would have been nice. I think I was just really enjoying my time over there. Sarah's one of those friends where even if I don't speak to her in like months, when we do see each other it's like no time has, has, has passed. I'm really happy that I made an effort to go out and see her because we took the love language test in like during Thanksgiving and her number one was quality time. And I believe mine was quality time as well. Um, and so I, I just knew, well, if I want to make, if I want to fulfill this love language, like I have to go make an effort to fly out more. Today is just a day of just getting my life back together. I've cleaned the house. I have put all, all my luggage away. Just basically my normal routine that I do when I get back from a big trip. I'm gonna go see my therapist today and I'm really excited because I try and see her at least two or three times a month. If you have like quite a cluttered mind like I do, it feels really good to just release it out to a professional. I mean, I recommend therapy to everybody. If you have the time and you have the funds to save up and go to therapy, I highly recommend it. I even asked my therapist if she had a therapist and she told me that she has one. So, I mean, <laughs> that speaks volumes. 
Also, there are definitely um, cheaper alternative alternatives for a therapist. I remember my first one I got with my healthcare, and it was only forty bucks per session. And I know, I know, it's still like forty dollars, but you can't put a price on mental health, even though technically I already did. Ladies and gentlemen, it's our pleasure to welcome you to Vancouver, where the local time is approximately twelve thirty p.m. Hello from Vancouver. I literally just landed like an hour ago and I just got to my hotel room, staying at the Shangri-La. It is so swanky up in here. Uh, but yeah, I am here in Vancouver with Ashley and Stephanie. We're gonna see the Takashi Murakami exhibition uh, at this museum. That's a couple of roads that way. But I'm so stoked because we actually get to meet him, which is insane. I don't really know what kind of look I want to do today because it's kind of rainy and dreary so maybe I'll do something more exciting to contrast the weather. I brought this like violet glitter eyeshadow from Stila. This is called Violet Vixen. I mean maybe I'll feel motivated to use this because it's been a long time since I've used color. Maybe I could use this tomorrow for the exhibition. But we'll see. Uh, either way, we're here until Saturday, so I'm so excited to explore. I hear that the Asian food here is so delicious, so I'm ready to, you know, get some gains. But since I'm the president of my show, I thought I could update you on the state of my year. <laughs> <laughs> to Vancouver! <laughs> give, give me the rest. Ashley literally <laughs> went for the fry. I was stabbing, and you took it off of my fork. How did you this whole area, and then you went for the fry that I was stabbing? Back in the hotel room, they gave us this really beautiful dessert inspired by Murakami. Beautiful. There's kind of like a mushroom structure, a macaron, some chocolates, and a chocolate brownie. Mmm. Mm. Uh, we're gonna have dinner later, and you're going uh, to the spa in like half an hour. I'm getting a massage. Yeah, dude. I'm so excited. So what, what can I expect in this massage? Just a lot of slippery, slippery stuff going on. You know, where are the arms? You don't know where the limbs are. You don't know where she's standing. Just a lot of smooth motion. Oh my god. That was the best massage ever. <laughs> That is the end of the January vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be prepared for our Vancouver trip or be prepared for more Vancouver clips in the February vlog. I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Bye.